Fuel siphoning is an essential skill for any homesteader, especially during emergencies. In this video, I'll guide you through the process of safely siphoning fuel, whether it's from a car or storage tank, so you're prepared when power outages or other situations arise. First, you'll need a good quality siphon pump, which can be manual or electric. Always wear protective gear, like gloves and goggles, since fuel can be hazardous. Before starting, ensure you know the fuel type, gasoline, diesel, or others, as each may require different handling. If you're using a traditional manual siphon, place the source container higher than the receiving one for gravity to help with the flow. To begin, insert the siphon hose into the fuel tank. The key is creating a vacuum that starts the fuel flowing. Once you've started the flow, carefully monitor the process. If you're using an electric pump, follow the manufacturer's instructions. With manual pumps, pump steadily to avoid stopping the siphon. Now let's discuss safety. Always make sure you're in a well-ventilated area to avoid inhaling harmful fumes. Keep any ignition sources far from your work area, as fuel vapor is highly flammable. Also, be mindful of the environmental impact of spills and have a plan for cleanup if needed. In terms of storage, remember to seal all containers properly and store them in a cool, ventilated space. It's essential for long-term fuel stability and your overall safety. Fuel siphoning isn't just about saving money or resources. It's a critical survival skill. With the right tools and knowledge, you can ensure that fuel is never wasted on your homestead.